what's the best way to teach your dog to be contented when you're busy doing other things and to learn to stay out of the traffic pattern which again results in a dog being less anxious it's tie out stations so all the time though i find that people don't implement the principles correctly here's a, what i'm talking about primarily make certain it is placed out of the traffic pattern that you're tying the dog low rather than at a high level um, and that you provide a dog bed and the tie out is short i was at a, a party a pool party where someone had the dog on a very long tie out i would guess that it was probably about eight feet long it was at the bottom of the staircase which was right in the pattern of ingress and egress for all of the guests. So the dogs here on a long tie out, tied kind of high on the railing there, and people are having to step around the dog, and the dog is very anxious. Another example of good tie outs being used poorly was when a friend was showing me his new German Shepherd dog. It was tied in the back of his van on a six foot tie out. He complained that the dog was pooping in the van. Well, no, <clears throat> uh, the dog should have been on a tie out that was only as long as from the back of the neck to the base of the tail. So we're talking about, you know, just for a German Shepherd dog, maybe about 16, 18 inches. Then the dog would have been settled into position may I walk? and everything would go just fine. Yes, you may walk. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, the joys of shooting at a hotel. Well, if that's the example I want to use. Until we speak, make certain with tie outs. It's short, tied low. There's a dog bed and it's out of the traffic pattern. 